Good morning, North Stars. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. We made it all the way to the end of the week. We feel really good about it. I feel good about it. You should feel good about it. Your first week of fourth quarter is done. I mean, this is fourth quarter, man. Let's power through to the end. You can, you can do it. We can all do it. We're all in this together, so to speak. So happy Friday. I really hope you have a good weekend. But until then, there's a lot of learning to be done. And something really to look forward to, the first epic book madness battle is today. Mr. Gebauer, this person here, versus Miss East, who is an ELA teacher in eighth grade. They're battling each other right now in your ELA classes. We will see which one reigns supreme. I have watched the videos. It's going to be a toss up. They're both really good. They're both really intense. Mr. Gabara says, vote for Mr. Gabara. Which one will reign supreme? I don't know. We'll see by the end of today. ELA teachers, don't forget to put the vote in so that we know who is going to reign supreme next week. Me versus Steinberger, a Spanish teacher. So that's another epic battle. And then the most epic battle, I would say, would be Kurt v. Kurt. Mrs. Kurt versus Mr. Kurt, that is in the third week. So there's a lot to look forward to. If you want to be part of this epicness and you're a student and you're like, hey, why can't I do it? You can, you can see Mrs. Kirsten's and you can sign up for your own very own student book battle later in April. So you can school you Mrs. Kirsten's and she'll be able to help you with all that. So I'm really excited about today, Mr. Gabar. Good luck. Or need it. All right. Um, congratulations to Busalaki, this week's Shining Staff Star Award winner. Uh, she was nominated by Danica for being so kind and giving students the best learning experience. Thank you, Ms. Busalaki. We appreciate your hard work. Um, students, please keep uh, nominating uh, your star staff members for this award. Think about um, all these hardworking adults in the building. Um, who is making the difference for you? Yes, congratulations, Mrs. Busalaki. We love you, love you, love you, and we're so glad you're here. I can tell that all your sixth graders who are watching this are going to be like, yes, we love her. So sixth graders, make sure to go and say, congratulations. You deserve it. You're awesome. We're glad you're here. She's a star for sure. Speaking of stars, Drama Club members, remember to get your spirit wear order in today. Orders are due today. Check your email for the link. Your first rehearsal will be next Tuesday at four and then our auditorium will get going. Love it. Drama. Love it. VIP is here today photographing all of our clubs and activities as well as band, orchestra, and choir. So um, listen closely, especially if you're in a club or activity. Uh, you're going to be reporting to the auditorium when your club is called. Mm -hmm. So listen to the announcements for your and a reminder, masks. We're going through the end, people. Mask on above the nose. We've got, got through this all year. Keep it going. This is a great way to keep each other safe. Okay? Mask on. You're already doing a great job with that. But hallways, classrooms, keep on keeping on North Stars. Keep everyone safe. Our ECT vocabulary word is estrange, which means to alienate, treat as a stranger, or turn an affectionate attitude into an in unfriendly attitude. So it's strange to be estranged from someone means to be happy with them and now you're not happy with them. As a result of her constant complaining, she became estranged from many of her friends. Mm. If you complain a lot, people will estrange themselves from you. They'll estrange themselves from you. That's not a correct way to use it, or stars. Are we doing the pledge now? <laughs> That's why we have a sentence. Uh, yeah, let's prepare for the pledge, please. I pledge allegiance to the flag, flag. of the United States of America, America and to the republic, to the republic which it stands, one, one nation, nation, under God, God indivisible, indivisible, liberty, liberty and justice, justice. From. All right, North Stars, have a great Friday. Enjoy your weekend. Choice is yours.